Hello everyone, back to into today's second video, so we're going to have a look at the weather uh, for Le Mans, which is an event that will be taking place in France in a couple of weeks' time. Uh, we're doing this for the Piss and Heads community who are off to uh, Le Mans uh, for the weekend of the 16th and 17th of June, and uh, this is a regular feature at Gals Web is now every uh, year, pretty much since we started in 2012, I think, we've been doing updates for the Piss and Heads uh, community for uh, Le Mans. And uh, this is no exception. I thought we'd have uh, a look tonight for your uh, first update. So, um, just say this is in the very extended range of the uh, GFS, so it's not to be uh, relied upon. The first week of updates, we're just looking for a trend from the model. And then the second week of updates, we um, kind of uh, start to pin down the detail. But for the first week, it's always the case. I see if we can get a trend. Um, and uh, sometimes we do get a trend very early on. That's happened over the past uh, years. Other times we will struggle to get a trend. There'll be loads of chopping and changing. It can be well on into the second week before we finally start to uh, pin it down. But we will do our best and endeavour to uh, see what's going to happen at Le Mans. Uh, and just to say that uh, if you uh, enjoy the video, if you think the uh, updates are useful, then please, uh, please press like on the uh, video player and then we know that you are enjoying uh, the content. And also you can subscribe to the YouTube channel. Right, so we'll start off on Friday, 15th of June, which is, of course, two weeks today. Uh, I think this will be the day that many people are uh, moving into uh, Le Mans and uh, taking up there or pitching up their tents uh, to uh, soak up the atmosphere and get ready for the event that will be starting uh, on the 16th of June. So the weather across France was very settled indeed. We have got low pressure close to the UK but for France we're actually under this ridge of high pressure from the Atlantic and extending out into central parts of Europe as well. Upper air temperatures looking quite hot down across France, so uh, certainly no problems from a temperature perspective, and it's almost universally dry uh, as well. Perfect uh, perfect weather for uh, arriving and uh, setting up your tents. And the temperature looks uh, really quite hot across northern parts of France as well. If you have a look at the scale, we can see that the temperature in France is, uh, well, southern France is over 30 degrees. In the north of France, sort of being to be upper 20, so 26 to 28 degrees uh, there across the northern parts of France into the 80s Fahrenheit. Will be very warm indeed. That's how things look for day one of Le Mans, which is Saturday, 16th of June. And we're under this ridge of high pressure that's extended in from off the Atlantic, it's pushing that ridge over to France. So um, plenty of dry weather there. Upper air temperatures are uh, warm to very warm across France. It's almost universal dry. Don't worry about that. Green air that's just picking up on cloud. Maybe light showers, but essentially it's dry across most of France. And uh, the temperatures, well, they're still looking very warm. The far north coast of France have cooled down a little bit, but most places are still into the mid to upper 20 Celsius on our scale. And then we go through to Sunday, which, of course, is the final day of Le Mans, and uh, Sunday 17th of June. And we're still under this large ridge of high pressures extending in across France from the Azores High. The upper air temperatures are remaining uh, warm or even very warm across many parts of France. It's dry as well, um, pretty much dry from start to finish across France, and the temperature looks warm. It's cooled down a little bit from what it was on Friday, but even so, we're still into the mid 20 Celsius quite comfortably. So, 25, for example, is uh, 77 Fahrenheit. That's about as good as it gets. It's a perfect update to start us off. It's dry from start to finish um, at Le Mans from the Friday through to the final day. It's very warm as well, especially to start off. We've just cooled down a little bit, but that'd be a bit of a relief actually from the heat uh, that you have on the Friday. It just goes back to uh, very warm conditions into the mid 20 Celsius. There'll be bags of sunshine as well. So I don't think it gets better uh, for uh, the event. And if it came off like that, obviously, uh, everybody would be really, really happy. But of course, it is only the first update. This is two weeks away. So we're up the boundaries of what the models are able to forecast and predict. So we're just going to wait and see whether 
Uh, this is a trend, and we'll know when we do the second update. That'll probably be with you on Sunday or Monday. Uh, we'll know when we do the second update whether um, that has uh, whether that's our trend or whether it's showing something else. But a really, really good update to start us off. So I hope you enjoyed it. Right, that's all for now. Come back Sunday or Monday for update number two. That's all for now, and thanks for watching.